Hello, 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 and welcome back to Let's Play Final Fantasy IX. In the last episode, we, uh, what did we do? We got to Lindblom, and we must now meet the regent. Tell him what's going on. Okay, let's just go down here. He's gonna take you back to the past to play some shitty games that suck ass. He rather have a buffalo take a diary and dump in his ear. He'd rather eat the rotten asshole of a rotten skull cat down in Big Bear. Lindblom Castle has three levels all connected by this lift. On the base level, which lies below the mist. You can take a trolley to the harbor and make gate. Ships hardly arrive at this harbor anymore since travel by air has become so popular. The mist poses great danger, so we've sealed off everything. Just above the base level is the mid level. You can ride the air cab from the mid level to go to town. The upper level contains the royal chamber and conference room. Access to that level is restricted because the regent himself resides there. Hey, Dag, what's the regent like anyway? I lived in Limbloom for a while, but I've never met him. Regent said he's very wise. He always thinks ahead. He may seem a bit odd at times, but he is very dependable. He and my father were best friends. I wonder if he'll even listen to what I have to say. Don't worry, we're not leaving until he does. We will arrive at the upper level shortly. Sire, Princess Garnet of Alexandria wishes to see you. Princess, is something wrong? The regent isn't here, I don't know who. Take a look at the throne. Huh? What in the world? Quack, quack. Quack, quack. Greetings. Oh, God. Oh. What? What? Dagger, what's wrong? Why are you, aren't you talking to... Jeez, that's an Oglob! Wow, even the Oglobs are big and limbo. What is the meaning of this? How dare you greet the princess like this? Get that repulsive bug off the throne immediately and call the regent! Please, settle down. You are before the regent. What, enough of your nonsense? Steiner, stand down. I remember that mustache. Is that really you, Uncle Sid? Yes, greetings all. I'm Sid Pabool, Regent of Limbo. I knew it was you. I recognize your pendant's description. It's so much like my falcon claw. I'm delighted to see you again, Garnet. You have truly become a fine lady. I, on the other hand... Allow me to explain. About six months ago, someone snuck into the castle and attacked the regent in his sleep. Unfortunately, we were too late. The regent had been transformed into an oglop by his, and his wife, Lady Hilda, was abducted. My goodness! Whoever pulled this off had to be highly skilled like me. Mm, I bet it was you. That is not possible. How can you be so sure? Do you even know who we are? Of course, I may be a bug, but I am still ruler of Limbloom. Uncle said I appreciate you seeing me on such short notice. I desperately need to speak to you about my mother. That's what I figured. But I'm sure I can wait until tomorrow. Why don't you all get some rest for today? Thank you. It is time for lunch. Please follow me. Can't stand the food at the castle. It's way too high class for my taste. How can anyone get full on that stuff? The cheap food here is a lot better. Today's special is soup to silence. Not bad. Hmm. 
Yo, Pops, I love the stupid special. Who said that? Zidane, I figured it was you. How have you been? Alright, I guess. Have a see, your soup will be ready in a minute. Do you mind? You're standing in everyone's way. Wow. Hey. Yeah, do you want a drink? How about you and I go for a cruise on an airship? Really, an airship? Sounds like you've never been on one. You know, Limbo is quite a sight from high above. Hey, Monkey Tail, you're disturbing the other customers. What? The, you got a tail too, Rat Face. Rat Face? After I finish my drink, I'm going to kick your butt. Hey, Zidane, take it outside. <sighs> Long time, Zidane. Hey, what's up? Wait a minute. You forgot my name? No, I remember. You're Helga, right? Rome. Christine. No! Oh, yeah. You used to live next door to me. How's it going, Rachel? Man, you've gotten big. You nasty little. Come on, I'm just kidding. You know I never forget a pretty girl's name. And we shall never. Freya. So, how you been, Freya? Same old Zidane. How long has it been? About three years. How did you ever find your do hey them me a little bit of a dry mouth situation going here? Hey, did you ever find anything about your boyfriend? No. So what brings you to Limblu? First of all of the hunt, what else? It's a good opportunity to test my skills. Oh well I'm sure you'll find him someday. Aren't you participating? Nah, I think I'll pass. Lazy bum. Are you ever gonna go back? I have no reason to return to Bermesia. There's nothing there for me anymore. Okay. So how is the queen? Is she still as vibrant as ever? Yes, but since father died, mother has been acting very strangely. I'm not surprised, but what? They loved each other so much. We haven't spoken much lately, also a suspicious man has been prowling around the castle. I don't know what's going on anymore, I feel that she might be planning something terrible. I've brought this matter to everyone's attention, but no one has taken me seriously. They all think I'm distraught of a losing follower. I understand why you're so eager. I'm happy that you came to me for help. At this point, I think you're the only person Mother would listen to. When I heard that Lindelum's theater ship was coming to Alexandria, I decided to sneak on board and come here no matter what. I just never expected the crew to kidnap me. It was me. I was the one who ordered Tantalus to kidnap you. Huh? I once promised your father that should anything happen, I would protect you. We've known about uh, the disturbances in Alexandria for some time, but we had acted direct. But had we acted directly, I would would have started a war. So I asked Baku for help. He and I go way back. The play was the perfect cover to, Ale to Alexandria and get you out. No one would suspect Limbloom was behind it. We were forced to take action because we knew Alexandria would never seek our help. I'm relieved we were able to get you here. At the village of Dali, we saw numerous black mages. They looked like golems, controlled by some powerful magic. On top of that, they were being created on Alexandria's supervision. I don't know how they're planning to Vivi. I don't know how they're related to Vivi, but if Mother is planning to use them for war... We won't let it happen. If she were to command an army of black mages, she won't make a move as long as we have our airship fleet. Don't worry, it won't talk. Everything will be fine. I'm so sorry, Uncle. Now, now, come on, don't be so formal. I'm helping you not. I'm helping you because I'm your Uncle Sid, not because I am the Regent of Limbloom. Thank you so much. What is this place? The heart and soul of Limbloom. When our, our airship dock, this is dock number one, where we conduct our research. But where are the airships? Lonely, isn't it? 
We had a new airship model in here about six months ago. It was our last cre latest creation. It didn't require mist to fly. The man who attacked you, was he the one who ran off with it? Good guess, but no, actually, I met a lovely lady at the pub. Um... When Hilda found out about my little affair, she used her magic and turned me into an oglob. Then she stormed off into the new airship, which I named Hildegard. Pretty ironic, eh? She hasn't been back since, Buck. I've been working on Hildegard too, but it hasn't been going too well. My mind just isn't the same as an oglob. I'm hopeless. But that doesn't mean I can't help you. I'll do my best for Alexandria. Thank you. Well, the Southgate badly damaged. I don't know how we can get to Alexandria. Don't worry, Southgate is being repaired as we speak. Once the repairs are finished, we'll go to Alexandria. Yes, I'm sure Mother will finally open her eyes to the truth. Uncle, is something wrong? Ah, uh, no, I was just thinking about how the theater ship crashed. Baku sure has good men working under him. Good morning. You're up early. Lim Bloom is really a busy place. I've never seen this many people before. I wonder where people go when they want to be alone. Lim Bloom has always been like this. People come here all, from all over the world. Some of them come from here to become in airship engineers, sculptors, actors. Wow. I don't even remember why I came here my first time. Before I knew it, I was living here with my Tantalus brothers. Do they still live here? Yeah, he, our hideout is in the theater district. I'm gonna go there right now, do you wanna come along? Um, that's okay, I'm gonna go look around town. Okay, then I'll give you a little tour. No, that's okay, I can go by myself. Oh, okay, go find yourself a cute girl, alright? Teach me mugs, dude. Hey bro, what are you going to teach me today? Lots of neat stuff. Today I'm going to talk about the synthesis shop. Gosh, bro, you should know a lot. Yeah, I know. Synthesis! It's great. It's a pretty cool aspect of this game. I like it. Let's just pop in here. There's a letter for Zidane. From Ruby to Zidane. Ain't y'all coming back to Alexandria? I'm so lonely. Just kidding. I'm opening a little theater in the alley here. The bartender of Elmont is putting the saloon and getting into showbiz. He asked me to help. Your friend is starting a mini theater? That sounds like fun, Capone. Alright, let's save the old game. It's gonna be the end of this episode, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, in the next episode, we'll continue to explore Limbloom. And uh, I think it should be pretty good. So, thanks a lot for watching, and have a great day.